Hi everybody, welcome to E-Prime for this evening. I am Daydrian. Dexter Daps announces a new album, Trilogy. That's the title of Dexter's new album scheduled for release on January 12th. His last release was the successful 2020 album Vent, which topped the US Billboard Reggae Albums list for three weeks. Dex adapts Grace to Jamaican Son in December with his trilogy tour, making stops in three locations, allowing patrons to enjoy the tour experience. Fans have been sharing their opinions on who they want to see featured on the album. Among the notable mentions are international stars like Rihanna, Thames and Burna Boy, as well as local acts Bugle, Shanil Muir, Diani, Jada Kingdom, Stock Ashley, Ikea and Leela Ike. Well, we may never know, so we wait. <laughs> Sun Nation is back! The Oriental Gardens at Mona saw hundreds of patrons turning out for the return of the New Year's morning annual staging of Sun Nation's Sunrise Breakfast Party. The event numbers signals a new post-COVID era for the return of the full event calendar. Ibram spoke with promoter of Sun Nation, Philip Pommel, who shared sentiments on the full return of events to the calendar year. As you know, COVID was rough for us, so we are not where we were in 2019. But we are building to get back there, you know. So everything has been the direct definition of incremental change, you know. It's just getting back bigger and bigger. We're building the momentum and then we're unstoppable again. And you know we're going to Trinidad. Trinidad is now the biggest sun nation. So it's actually bigger in Trinidad than in Jamaica at the present moment. Palmer says that Dream Weekend is already in full gear and welcomes others who have entered the space. Dream continues to be the favorite destination for especially the people from UK, Toronto especially. So we just continue to expand the brand. So big up all the movements who keep in the entertainment industry you know, popping. Big up the government for supporting us. Also in attendance, director of Isle of Soca, Andrew Bellamy, added on the growth of Isle of Soca, which drew a massive crowd. We're just working on figuring out how to make it bigger and better. We're, we just want it to become a household name. I mean, it's well known. I mean, we're just not going to drop the ball. We always want to evolve the brand, and that's what we're about. Entertainment has contributed billions to the economy, with the rise of Carnival, Dream Weekend, and festivals like Sumfest and Ripple Salute. Shensia, TJ and Ding Dong repped the 876 at Hot 97 Winter Jam. The trio were among a lineup of international acts that dominated the stage at Barclays Center in New York. They delivered some of their biggest hits lighting up Barclays Center. <laughs> That's it for E Prime this evening. I am Daydran. Thank you for watching. E Prime.